Good morning. It is a dreary, rainy Friday morning, and we took an unexpected road trip. I thought I was going to spend all day today working in the office. No, we... <laughs> I found on Facebook this <laughs> consignment sale for, like, kids and family stuff, and the picture gallery looked incredible i showed ben like okay we got to go here this morning mm -hmm. there's so much stuff in there uh, we're gonna try to get we we'll try to get some spy cam yeah, footage we'll try for to you get guys some spy cam footage with the phone it's a lot easier to do that with the phone because i can just carry it like i'm carrying it awkwardly and still <laughs> get like footage which is what i did last weekend so we have no idea what to expect really so hopefully we come out with a nice haul we got some boxes, we got some bags, we got some money, so we're going to go shopping. I hope we didn't jinx ourselves. <laughs> because this is actually in a old roller dome. Yeah. So, I, I don't know what to expect, so come on, let's go. Let's get some deals. Tell that it's a staple in every child's childhood. <laughs> we are back in the car. It took some digging, but there was some treasure to be found. At first, when we wa first walked in, I was like, oh no, <laughs> this was a waste of time. The but... prices were all over the map because it was a consignment sale, so everybody priced their own stuff different. But we found some really, really cool stuff. Mm -hmm. Some stuff we just took a shot in the dark right. on. We have no idea. It just sort of looked cool. Yeah. But we'll show you our haul when we get home. We're going to have to do some research on some of it. But I'm pretty confident. We spent $41 in there. Right. And I'm pretty confident that we had an awesome haul. I think Wait so. Wait you guys check it yeah. out. Yeah. Some stuff we bought, you know, uh, not a lot, but some stuff we just bought for us. I think maybe like two things. I was like, I'm trying to think. What did we buy for ourselves? <laughs> Everything else <laughs> we bought to sell. So, so there is a Goodwill around here mm -hmm. down the road. We're going to check that out. And then we're going to head home and show you our toy haul. We made it to Goodwill. So we're going to go in and see if maybe we can find something. Maybe. maybe. Last stop of the day. Because yep. I, got, I got to work later today. And Ben has to get some work done too. Right. Well, you've been working. Technically, this has been working for you. Well, technically, but it isn't <laughs> what I planned on working on today. Okay, so let's take a look at what we got. Um, this is what we got at the Goodwill store. I picked up a little bottle of shells for craft projects that I've been working on slowly. I actually have, I've been wanting to do a video and I've started a video, but, um, I needed to order more stuff, so I haven't finished it yet, but um, I'm, work I'm working on it slowly. <laughs> uh, and I also picked up two books for Tegan, uh, The Zombie Chasers and Shark School, um, for him to read at night. Well, he doesn't read them. John reads them to him. So those are those. And then for resale purposes, uh, I picked up this little Christmas ornament. Um, it's so cute. I thought it was super cute. Little saddle and horseshoe and presents and stuff. I thought that was adorable. I have no idea what we paid for this because the sticker was gone and um, I had gone to go get this box. So I don't even know what she rung it up as. So I have no idea what we paid for it. <laughs> uh, John picked up these little cassette boxes. They are for storage or mailing. Like, check these out. Aren't these cool? So there are nine of them in here. Uh, you know, who knows? I don't know. And look at this. This is a rose from the Golden Girls decorative planter. How funny is that? I thought that was hilarious. I got some wall hooks for a dollar. And check this out. Look, 
we have a set of six cat switch plate covers. I have to open this up and see if all of them are there. Hold on. Oh my goodness, they are. Look at that one. <laughs> oh my gosh, these are too funny. Here's that. Um, that one. Like, do you have a cat lover in your family? Because these are hilarious. Like, they're perfect for that little cat lady. <laughs> Chad, Chad Allen needs these for his house. Oh my gosh. Somebody tell Chad about these. He needs these. Tell him to go look them up on eBay. <laughs> we'll sell them to him cheap. Oh my gosh, how funny are those? And we also picked up three of these jumbo sponge mop refills. They were a dollar a piece, so we'll lot them together. All three for one. And then I also, John found these. We have seasons one through five of Supernatural. They were all $2 a piece. And they say pre-owned, but they are all shrink-wrapped. So they are brand new. Never been opened. So he picked those up. And, you know, I don't want to sell them. Because you guys know that Supernatural is my favorite show. Love, 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 love it. Um, but uh, I can watch it <laughs> on Netflix right now, so I don't need it all. And when next season is going to be the last season, I just want to buy a full set when it's done. So we're going to sell those, but oh, Supernatural breaks my heart to sell. So that is all we got from the Goodwill was this box of stuff right here. But then from the other place... We got all of this stuff. <laughs> so we have this little bag of assorted toys. Now the reason I picked this up is for this briar horse right here. This like goldish green briar horse. So I picked that up. But there's, you know, some other stuff mixed in in here. But um, that was the reason why I picked that one up was for that horse. And we also got this bag of small toys. But they are all, um, all little vintage Smurfs, except for little Indiana Jones and Mickey in there. I don't know if you can see him, but he's right there, little Indiana Jones and Mickey. But these Smurfs are from 1978. So these are vintage Smurfs. And I picked up this doll. I don't know anything about her yet. But I picked her up. She was only $3. I thought it was a good price. I don't know. Because um, she's in really good shape. You know, her hair's nice. Her clothes are nice. I believe she's a Bratz doll. Right? So, uh, I'm going to look her up a little bit more. I don't know anything about her for sure. Um, John found this. It is a Rockabye Baby <laughs> uh, Lullaby CD. But they're all Coldplay songs. And we thought that was pretty cool. So we picked that up for three bucks. Um, and we'll list that. We just thought it was unique and cool. And John also found this black and white platinum pack. We have no idea um, what this game is. Um, but we, we picked that up. We couldn't, we couldn't do any research on this stuff. While we were there because the cell phone service was horrendous. We couldn't check anything. So this was all just blind picks. We didn't know what we could get for any of it. But we did get this Agent Oso in a Whirly Bird copter. And I did turn it on and it makes noise. So that's good. We got this for five bucks. But, you know, you never see Oso stuff. So we picked up the er Whirly Bird. And then we picked up... Some of these. These are the big ones right here. We found this Rugrats doll, the singing pop star Susie, the all grown up Rugrats doll. But they, d she doesn't work. You push her belly and nothing happens. So we think the batteries are dead. But this is a good deal. We got her for five dollars, and um, they go. I think they can go for like fifty a piece. I think is what John said. I'm not really sure. And we also got the matching Kimmy. So we have Kimmy here. 
she doesn't play anymore either but there she is and, you know they're still in their boxes they are pretty good you know the boxes are a little beat up but the dolls themselves are still in there i don't remember exactly what we can sell these guys for but we picked them up for five dollars we thought it was worth it and in one of these boxes we got a bonus power rangers <laughs> she was she was stuck in one of these boxes and i just pulled her out so we got a bonus power ranger and lastly we got this the as seen in the brats genie magic dvd we got the genie magic royal castle from brats and this is katia from the genie magic dvd and this is a two-in-one genie castle that transforms into a late night lounge you have all these accessories and um she's in really good shape brand new never been opened and it was from kb toys so it kind of tells you that it is older older brat doll not a new one right off the bat there's only one listed on uh ebay right now uh well actually i can think there's a couple that have been sold but Thing, we think this is a pretty good buy. I think I think John said like $80 for this. So she looks really good in there. So those three were our big purchases at the consignment shop. So I still don't know exactly what we can sell for any of this for, but we had a pretty good, you know, pretty good day picking out all of this stuff. And um, I can't believe how much of that consignment shop had been sold already. John was showing me pictures of it from when they posted it on Facebook yesterday. And there were tons of strollers, which we weren't looking for, but they had tons of strollers, tons of uh, road bikes, um, car seats, pack and plays, like all of that kind of stuff. And all of that was gone today. They had a lot of clothes, but the clothes I thought were way too high priced. The clothes, they were like what you could buy them new at Walmart. You know, they were way too much. Uh, but they had all of like the toys and the you know, everything. I think they have sold a lot since we were there, uh, since they posted the picture and when we got there. So they've only been open one day. They sold so much stuff. And they're open again tomorrow for, and it's a 50% off day. So that place is going to be wiped out, I'm sure. So anyway, we had a really good time. We got a lot of good stuff. And now I have like 15 minutes before I have to pick Tegan up. So I'm not even going to get any work done today. I got shopping done. I didn't get any work done. So the skit's going to be late because I have no idea when I'm going to get it done now. I'm going to have to stay up late to finish it. <laughs> so I think that is it for today, though. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. That's all for today. Oh, man.